Good afternoon guys and welcome back to another video. So today we are here at Viking Gym. It's back to front. <laughs> I'll have to change, I'll have to edit that because that logo needs to be the other way around. Anyway, so we're down here at Viking Gym for part two of my video about the big question of how do I lose weight. And uh, yeah, so today we're going through part two, the gym session, show you guys exactly what it is on a daily basis we do to lose weight. And now we're here with uh, Liam. Baby brother, this is my baby brother Liam, uh, sporting the alias attire hoodies, this is his brand. So, you know, check these guys out, check the hoodies, check the t-shirts, check out his Facebook in the link, and uh, yeah, let's get in there and smash a full body workout. Are you ready for this? Let's get on it. Let's do it. Let's do it. By the way, he's 22, I'm 42, it's 20 years between me. I, have I, to I just have to throw that in on every Same video. parents as well. Same parents. Same parents. <laughs> okay, let's go do this. <laughs> let's smash it. Well, that's it. Training session done. Big full body workout, push pull, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling pretty tired. Liam, how about you? Yeah, not gonna pop in the fat burner. <laughs> <laughs> well, you see, pre workouts, fat burners. This is what they do. They give you plenty of energy. But are you hungry? Hungry and sweat. Okay, so uh, that is it for our training session today here at Viking Gym with the logo back front. I need to work out and fix that. And uh, yeah, so we will see you again soon. I will be showing you. Obviously all day what I'm going to be eating while trying to lose weight. So now it's time to get back home and uh, get some chicken and rice made. Standard, but has to be done. So 
So until we get back to the kitchen and back at home, we will see you guys later. Remember, alias attire. Alias attire. Get yourself a hoodie, t-shirt. You heard it here. With Lee Mealy. Quality. Alias attire. Look at that colour. <laughs>
Okay, so while the chicken is just cooking here on a medium heat, all I'm gonna do is simply add a little bit of salt, give it some extra taste, and some cracked black pepper. Um, but you know, obviously if there's any chefs watching this program, you know, I am not a trained chef. I am uh, you know, not the world's greatest cook, but you know, these are the sort of foods which, which are ideal for me, whether I wanna get lean or wanna get more size on, or just increase the portions. But yeah, chicken, turkey, rice, fish, broccoli, potatoes, all these sort of things, asparagus, these are all sort of healthy foods which you need. And you can see it doesn't take long to cook these foods. It's not rocket science. You just cook some chicken in a pan, a little bit of olive oil spray. Uh, I need to pop the rice in now. So the water is now boiled. So now I'm just gonna add the rice to the water. So while the rice is cooking and the chicken's cooking, I'm now gonna pop the broccoli in the microwave. Just the way I like to do it, nice and simple, really quick. Okay, I'll be honest, I'm not a massive fan of broccoli. I mean, who actually is a fan of broccoli? But, you know, I know it's really, really good for you, full of fiber, very nutritious. So I'm not gonna go too crazy with broccoli. I'm just gonna chop off a few of these broccoli heads. I think that's what you call them, I'm not too sure. Sounds good though. Broccoli heads. Okay, I'm just gonna chop off a few of these, enough for to make two meals. I'm literally just gonna pop them into this container. Easy as that. Uh, I tell you what though, broccoli is ideal when you're dieting because broccoli is obviously quite fibrous, full of fiber and when you are dieting and you need to feel a little bit more fuller, broccoli is ideal for that. That's why most athletes and bodybuilders will tell you they literally have broccoli with every meal because it makes a big difference. So there your broccoli is now in the container. I'm just going to add a little bit of water, pot in the microwave for a couple of minutes and that will be the broccoli done. Okay, I'm just going to pop the broccoli in the microwave for a couple of minutes. That should do. So the broccoli is now cooking. The rice is simmering nicely. Chicken is almost done. Now the last ingredient which I add is a little bit of asparagus. So what I'm going to do is just chop up a little bit of this and literally add it in my chicken. And then once that's cooked, I'm going to add a bit of this sauce. It, it's just Italian tomato and basil. It can be any pasta sauce. You know, I like to use this one or I like this one as well. Spicy chili. Now I like my asparagus quite crunchy, so I'm just going to cook it for a short period of time. That is literally it. You can see, just diced up finely. Nothing flash, nothing extreme. Just, there we go. And then I'm just going to add that into the chicken and give it a stir and uh, that will be it. Okay, so the rice is now cooked, nice and fluffy. Just gonna strain it, take all the water out of it. And there you have it, nice fluffy white basmati rice. Okay, as you can see now, the chicken is literally almost done. The asparagus is cooked nicely, just enough to give it a little crunch when you bite it. That's exactly how I like it. And then I'm just gonna add a little bit of this sauce in, just to get a little bit of a taste. Not too much, just half a jar. Not even half a jar. Give it a stir. Let that simmer for a couple of minutes. Okay, so we now have two meals ready with the rice. So that is um, 50 grams dry weight in each. Now it's obviously cooked. And add the chicken and asparagus. Try to obviously uh, spread them out evenly. Always make a mess here. It's gonna go on the floor, isn't it? There we go. Chicken and asparagus with a nice Italian salsa sauce. There we go. And then the last thing to add is the broccoli, which was cooked in the microwave for two minutes with just a little bit of water. And now this broccoli is just nice and soft with a tiny bit of crunch. Again, that's how I like my asparagus. 
that's how I like my uh, broccoli as well. There we go. And there you have it, the end result is two nutritious meals, cooked in about 10 minutes, very easy to make, very simple to make, very quick to cook, obviously very nutritious. Ideal if you're dieting, trying to lose weight, if you're prepping for a competition, if you're trying to bulk up and get bigger, then obviously same food, just bigger portions, very simple to make. Um, so now time to grab one of these meals because I am starving and then it is off to the gym again where I work because I'm gonna be teaching body pump in about an hour and a half's time. So once I finish that body pump class, I will then have an this well, one of these meals, the second one. And then at the night time before I go to bed, I'll be having pretty much the same meal which I had for breakfast. I always have the same meal for breakfast as I have for supper before I go to bed. So it'll be an omelette. If I'm really, really hungry and I feel like I need the carbs, I'll just add some porridge and that's a more meal. As simple as that. So you know, you've looked at my daily routine the day, we've looked at the cardio in the morning on an empty stomach. Then showed what I cooked for breakfast. We went to see my nutrition sponsors. After that, I met my little brother and we went to the gym, did a full upper body workout, cooked some food, chilling out a little bit, and then back to the gym to teach body pump. Um, so yeah, that's an interesting one. I've been teaching body pump for about 14, 15 years. So yeah, I'm gonna need these calories. And then when I finish the body pump, I will have the second meal. And uh, yeah, supper after that. So I will see you guys later. I hope this video has been helpful. I hope it gives you some good advice and good some tips. As you can see, the question which I get asked all the time is how do I lose weight? It's not that hard. It is hard, but it's not that hard. If you put the effort into it, take the time, then you're gonna lose weight. You've seen exactly what I do on a day-to-day -day basis, cardio in the morning, training in the afternoon, I'll be teaching body. Yeah, it's a lot of exercise, but once your body gets used to it and you get used to it, these things become routine, become easy. You know, if you put the effort into it, you work hard, you're gonna get the results that you're really great for. It's uh, as simple as that. So yeah, train hard, train smart, and I will see you for the next video. Catch you guys later. Okay, so we are now here at Body Zone Fitness in Newcastle. This is the gym where I work and do my personal training and also where I teach all my fitness classes, body pumps, spinning circuits, you know, I teach pretty much everything. Um, so you've seen my daily routine. We did some cardio this morning on an empty stomach before breakfast. We then uh, went to see the uh, supplement sponsors, picked up some goodies. We then went to the gym with my baby brother and we did a full upper body workout. Uh, a bit of food, bit of shopping, and here we are back where I work, because now I need to do an evening body pump class. Uh, I've been teaching body pump now for around 14, 15 years, I think, so I absolutely love the Les Mills classes. I only teach body pump, so all my participants should be here soon. So now I need to get my uh, bench and all the equipment set up, ready for a body pump class. If you've never did body pump, check out the body pump website or the les mills website if you want a really good full body workout muscle endurance you want to burn a lot of calories give body pump go i mean body pump has been worldwide for years it is like the, the leading brand in fitness les mills whether it's cardio combat grit the rpm classes obviously body pump it is uh, it's a really 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 good workout um i would like to try and get some footage of the class but obviously i have to respect the privacy not everybody's going to want to be on camera so you know, i might try and get a little can view of all the participants getting ready for the class so uh, yeah let's give it a go let's get some body pump.